Jimmy Hunt again. Hey, I'm glad you're here at my shop. I've got something I want to talk to you about. I've got an incubator. It's a model 1202. It's a GQF cabinet style of incubator. And man, it does a great job. I've already got it working. It's on, ready for eggs. My problem is, is that the egg holder that I have is, this is a quail egg instead of a chicken egg holder. And I've tried to buy some. Uh, matter of fact, either you have to buy it or make it. And I was gonna buy some more, but I can't find any around here at all. So I decided that I'm gonna make them. I am gonna buy them online. You can't get them online and I'm gonna do that. But right now I need to get some eggs in there. So I'm gonna make it. How do you do that? Let me show you. Let me look inside our incubator. And it's got a shelf here you can see that the holder goes in and then when it turns, it will hold the eggs. And so the problem is, is I have nothing to hold it. I made something, you can see it here. It's out of egg cartons and uh, it's holding my eggs good. They're warm. Everything seems to be working great in that situation. So we're gonna walk over to the table after I get this thing locked down. Yep. And uh, I'm gonna show you kind of what I've done and how it works. All right. So here's my shelf. And you can see that I have uh, just regular egg cartons. These were by Lando Lake. They're, um, they have the opening and then opens up there. And uh, I've just cut, cut that off and put it, laid them in, laid two and a half in there. And so it, it really, it's really pretty good. It don't move a lot, especially when the uh, eggs are there. It makes it heavy enough to where it don't move around a lot and the eggs don't fall off. Hey, I hope that this has helped you out a lot. And uh, sometimes we just have to improvise. Uh, am I gonna buy some? Absolutely I am. I'm gonna order them here when I get off line. But the fact is, is that sometimes we just gotta improvise and do what we need to do. Hey, that even happens in life, doesn't it? Sometimes we just gotta improvise and do what we need to do. Hey, I hope God blesses you. See you later.